This video is brought to you by CatBeast.com. Design your own custom snapbacks and hats. Hey guys, what is up? Teddy here and today I will teach you guys a move called shoulder thread. I think that a lot of you guys might like this move because first, it looks really cool and secondly, it looks really advanced. But there are two things that you need to master. The first one, of course, is shoulder freeze. You need to have a good shoulder freeze. If you haven't learned shoulder freeze, I put the link beside me, it will take you there, alright? Now, second thing is the transition where you left on the ground to shoulder freeze. Okay, I'm just gonna quickly go through these two things that you need to master and then I'm gonna get into the shoulder thread. Now, let's try um, the transitions from left on the ground to shoulder freeze. This is very crucial, so you need to master this. All right, if I'm using my right shoulder, I'm gonna keep my right leg straight, all right? So this leg is gonna use to swing up where I put my momentum and then I'm gonna turn my body around. So one, two, three. All right. It takes time to really get used to the, the transitions, but no worry. It's just pretty simple concept, swing and turn. Now, after you master that, it's time to do the shoulder thread. Instead, after swing and put our leg on top of us, you want to make sure that this time your left foot is touching your right hand. When it's touching your right hand, you're gonna grab it, all right? So let's try it out, and I'm gonna show you guys how it looks so you guys can have a better idea. See? Now, this is where I told you guys that shoulder freeze, the basic shoulder freeze, is really, is really important. Now, what I did just now, I only control my balance with one of my shoulder without any help of my left hand. So you get it now? Really, really master the basic shoulder freeze if you want to learn this move. All right, after I'm grading my left foot with my right hand, I'm creating a space. Like I always said, if you want to do a thread, you need a space or you need to create space. Just now we already create space. My left foot, my right hand, and you can see that this is the space that we created. What we want to do next, we want to enter my right leg into it. All right, so after my left, right leg enter the space, I'm gonna put both of me, my knees down, bring my body up, turn, and stand up. It's that simple. One more time. Keep that in mind. Grab, enter your right leg, put both of your knees on the ground, and stand up. Here we go. Okay, so there you go, shoulder thread. For this tutorial, I'm just gonna show you that um, do the shoulder thread to standing up. Actually, if you want to keep that or bring that to the next level, this move is for you to continue your, your other transitions. Either it's footwork, freezers, or even power. All right, so I leave that to you guys based on creativity. So that's about it, shoulder thread. Hope you like it. If you have anything that you want to learn, let me know in the comment section below and I will try to deliver it to you guys. So that's about it. Subscribe, like this video, give a thumbs up, and I will see you guys 